Hello guys, welcome to Solving Solutions on one channel where I get solutions to all your solving problems. It's nice having you in class again today. How have you been? On today's tutorial, we are going to show you how to get flow direction and flow accumulation using um, ArcGIS Pro. And then we are going to use um, a digital elevation model for this tax, right? Good. So simply put, the direction is um, the direction the water will flow naturally over a surface right good so it's actually gotten from a digital elevation model then the accumulation is how much water passes through each cell in a digital elevation model assuming water flows down hill according to the flow direction raster so the flow direction raster will give us the flow accumulation so let's see a better symbology for this okay now we come to geoprocessing and then first of all let us try to fill our dam so we search for fill right good so it fills the sinks in that uh, raster which is the digital elevation model so the output let's leave it as default as it is and then we run having filled the dam let's now search for flow direction so we have the flow direction here the input will be our field them and then the output will be as it is and then let's use this um, flow direction type which is the d8 right good so if you use the information here you are going to see a um, description about each of them right good and then let's run so this is the flow direction according to the values right good so each cell in this raster grid is assigned a value indicating which of its eight neighboring cells using the the eight uh, method which we selected water will flow into based on what the deepest descent right good so we have about eight of them here then the next we are going to look for is the accumulation which is this creates a raster of um, accumulated flow into each cell then the flow direction will be an input and then we are still using the d8 the and then we click on run good so we have the flow accumulation here so each cell in this um, output raster shows the total number of upstream cells that flows into it right good based on the flow direction raster now going further we are going to use this to generate some results in um, hydrology like um, the stream network drainage patterns drainage density and the rest of that but this is just like a foundation for you to understand how to get the flow direction and then the flow accumulation so thanks for coming to class we open we have provided solution to this particular problem if you find the video interesting you can encourage us by subscribing share with your friends turn on notification and then we'll see you with some more interesting tutorials on the channel until then keep staying safe and have a fantastic time bye